y'all. Welcome to Bluff City Life with me, Gina Neely. We have a great show planned for you today, so grab your lunch and come on back. This partnership hopes to give those transitioning from homelessness a safe place to start. See the new project IKEA and the Hospitality Hub envision for Memphis and how other partnerships give their guests a treat to boost esteem. But first, let's get ready for the rodeo. There's one place where you can learn the art of wrangle and this Northwest Wednesday, we're headed to Senatobia, Mississippi. I've never been a bull rider by trade. It went all right for a second until he jumped on me. <laughs> Santa Tobia, let's do it! The crowd, they love us. They love us. They come out and they show out. Team roping is my favorite event by far. Some people like to play basketball or play football, but I like to rope. I've been rodeoing ever since I was a little kid, and I started junior high and high school rodeoing in Tennessee. The collegiate level is definitely tougher, and they're stricter about the rules, you know. It's more professional. It definitely teaches you resilience, you know. If you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and just keep pushing forward, you know. In Northwest, we have one of the best coaches in the region. And Will's a great teacher. Reserve world champion two years in a row. He's a multiple time NFR qualifier. He, he's as good as it gets really when it comes to bulldogging. He helps every one of us. He's on our side 100% of the way. We have a team uh, point system in college too, so it's not just everybody doing their individual things. So we have to work like a well-oiled machine and work together. Most of these people I didn't know before we got here other than just a few of them. And we're all really close now. We hang out, you know, and if anybody needs help around here, we're all willing to pitch in and help and do whatever needs done. We work the shoots for each other whenever, strip, strip the cattle, pull the ropes off, pull the bull ropes, whatever needs done, we help each other. We have steer wrestling. We've got team roping, calf roping, barrel racing, breakaway roping. We've got saddle bronx and barebacks. Of course, wants to come up and say hi. Uh, this is my main horse. His name's Jose. Uh, I got him when he was five years old. He didn't know, know nothing other than just how to ride around and be broke. And I trained him myself, and now he's my main man. For a community college, they've really surprised me on how big it is. We have a Chick-fil-A. I've never seen that before in a community college, you know. We have a really good facility here. We have a big, nice covered arena, so even when it's a rough day outside like it is today and it's raining and windy, we can still come out here and rope and practice. A lot of colleges, they don't have an indoor arena. And we'll make sure we have the best of the best equipment and best opportunity to be successful that we can. It's about more than just competing, you know. It's it's a way of life for me. I just like going out there and doing anything that has to do with being a cowboy, you know. 